when Cal State LA was called LA State. My student experience, which extended from 1951 through 1959. My name is Joseph A. Bagnall. I earned my BA in elementary education at LA State College in 1955. My MA in history and political science at LA State College in 1959 and my doctorate in education at UCLA in 1973. In the fall of 2022, I made a documentary film entitled What Cal State LA Means to Me. The film covered my student experience at Cal State LA in the period 1951 through 1959. At this time, Cal State LA was called Los Angeles State College. When I enrolled in LA State College in 1951, we didn't have a campus of our own. Our classes were held in the available classroom space on the Los Angeles City College campus. Fast forward to 2022. I shared my production, What Cal State LA Means to Me, with Cal State LA Public Affairs Administrator, Jillian Beck. And she invited me to a meeting on our Cal State LA campus. I explained that at age 92, I could not handle a trip to our campus. Then she asked if we could meet near my home. I responded with an invitation for her to meet with me in my home in Oceanside, California. Jillian Beck agreed and a few weeks later, she arrived in Oceanside with Cal State LA videographer Emilio Flores. They interviewed me on film in my home. I was genuinely surprised and deeply honored when part of their Oceanside footage was used in President William Covino's Fall 2022 Convocation Address. Here is how that went. Cal State LA opened its doors in 1947 and soon became a part of the allure of Southern California and its golden narrative. If Southern California was heralded as a place for new dreams and fresh starts, then Cal State LA, a premier public university in the heart of the city, was the rich soil that dreams and fresh starts require. Earlier this year, we heard from one of our older alumni who attended the first decade of the university's history back when we were still known as Los Angeles State College, or LASC, and our mascot was the Diablo. 92-year-old Joseph Bagnall reached out to us with what I call a recorded thank you letter. For 61 years, Joseph was an educator whose deep love for Cal State LA has not waned. He's not forgotten the names of the professors who taught and inspired him, and he also has not forgotten the university's fight song. Let's hear from Joseph.
92-year-old Joseph Bagnall attended the university during its first decade. And look at this football team, 1955. Amazing. But I can't, I can't overstate what happened to me at Cal State LA. It opened every door, every door career-wise that I experienced. And my friends <clears throat> here today say, my goodness, I don't feel that way about any school I attended. But I do, I sincerely do. Joseph created a YouTube video expressing his appreciation for his time at Cal State LA. Dr. McDonald arrived Los Angeles State with Professor John Tipple required rigorous graduate research. LA State prepared me to write a popular US history survey. Nobody has seen my story on my YouTube channel. Virtually no viewership, but it's out there. And I want, once again, I, Cal State has shaped me, shaped my character, shaped my attitudes, gave me the skill set, that's my story. I don't care if only 11 people see it. It's always out there, isn't it? Forever. I don't know, at age 92, I deeply appreciate everything more than I ever have. I love life, I love my experiences, the, the sacred experiences in your life, the meaningful experiences. When you come to this stage of your own life, you'll realize how important parts of your life were and how important people were in your lives. A guest lecturer came in and announced that she was going to teach us the newly composed L.A. State fight song. I still remember the words and the tune. Okay, one, two, three. Boom, 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 boom. Go, Diablos. We're behind you all the way. Go, Diablos. Black and gold is here to stay. Go, Diablos. We will fight for victory. We will fight, 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 fight with all our might for dear old LASC. <clears throat> no. I messed up on the last line. Many thanks to our videographer, Emilio Flores, for that moving video. Emilio, thank you. And listen, go watch his YouTube, will you? I mean, that'd be a big surge, you know, if you just, it's about a half an hour long. <laughs> it talks all about the university in great detail. And you really, you really have to watch it. It's on YouTube, Joseph Bagnall, there it is. A lot has changed since Joseph's time at the university, including our name and our mascot. But students in those then and now photos share one thing in common. Their lives were not the same after they graduated from Cal State LA. Please visit my production on YouTube titled 
what Cal State LA means to me.